I 10 westbound in Hancock County now open again that after being closed and then down to one lane for 10 hours because of a deadly accident at the Mississippi state line. Two brothers from South Carolina killed in the crash. Parker Boyd shows you the traffic nightmare that gripped the interstate for a big portion of the day. It was bad. It was really bad. This just one of thousands of people stuck in traffic when a deadly tractor trailer accident shut down the westbound lanes of I-10 in Hancock County. I'm just thinking it was just a little plain little wreck and they were just clearing up the stuff, but it wasn't. It was the corners. Bringing, Lord Jesus. Brothers Ole and Yakov Tarasovich of South Carolina died when their 18 wheeler that was hauling cars went off the interstate near the state line and crashed into a tree. Officials say this happened at 3 a.m. and impacted the westbound side of the interstate until 1 in the afternoon. The wait was so long, people flocked to the Mississippi Welcome Center to wait for the interstate to open again and save gas. You were out in the traffic for how long, you say? Uh, about two hours. Hour and a half. Yeah, maybe a little Approximately. Bit. Mississippi Highway Patrol Corporal Cal Robertson says crashes like this don't get cleared right away. Anytime that you have this type of wreck, uh, you know, hauling cars, this is a large scale wreck. It's a lot of moving parts. It takes a lot of people uh, to get this cleaned up. The lives of those lost in this accident haven't left the minds of those who continue to wait here at the Mississippi Welcome Center. I hope they take as long as they need to to investigate the cause of the accident so that the families get some sort of closure. God is in the midst of it all, is all I can say. I mean, it's all I can say is I pray for him. I'm sorry. No word yet on what caused the crash. In Hancock County, Parker Boyd, WLOX News Now. Mississippi Highway Patrol is investigating the cause of that crash.